got a raggedy small apartment. Oh my god. What's up babies? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. If you have been here, welcome back to another video. So today we are filming Life of Yasmin episode four today. Um, so you might be like, who the f is this Sim? Who is this? Why she look, who is this lady? So this is Yasmin's best friend. I forgot her name. That is sad. I forgot her name. I made her and everything. Well, I made her a while ago. This is Trinity Martin. This is Yasmin's best friend. She's visiting Yasmin, so she's staying with her for a little bit. And like, you know, cooking. She's cooking breakfast right now for the both of them. Yasmin is still asleep. She is a early riser. The way that Yasmin is like, is now, I feel like her best friend coming here to like, you know, just, what is this? See, y'all be just be here to you know support her friend and everything i just feel like it's a good thing for her because one jasmine is dating two people yeah two people best and are you getting their names y'all i know her name just not gonna look but jasmine's dating two people and you remember back in like episode two at the end of it i believe uh she got her best friend to come visit her i told you somebody's gonna be coming and this is her um this is again this is trinity she is self-assured a genius, charming, gregarious, uh, okay, jester, and a sage. Journey is a photographer. She is starting to model as well. Like I said, if you remember episodes back, we mentioned about Trinity, not Trinity, Yasmin doing more things with her life, not just the painting career. We want her to get into other things so she can make more money. Um, we're gonna ignore this amount of money. I forgot how much she had last episode. I'm saying it was like two thousand dollars. So we're gonna have you know Trinity come out and help her. We're gonna go out with her. We're gonna you know take her out. We're gonna take her out to a club maybe or out somewhere else. I don't know if it's gonna be a club per se, but we got some little shopping areas we can go to. We also have the photo shoot that Trinity wants to take Yasmin to because she did a research before coming to Sam you know. And then I guess we can go, you know, just out as best friends or just stay in and make sushi because I'll see the sushi board and it's popped in my mind. But we're going to go ahead and get started. And then go ahead, look at her. She is a cutie with a body. She was doing it on the yoga mat. Now she's making her her bestie some breakfast. Like, yes. I don't know if you guys can hear the game. I might turn it up a little bit more so that y'all can hear it. Uh, I'll put it like right here so y'all can hear the game more look at her cooking breakfast please don't burn Yasmin's apartment down I don't have time Yasmin oh she's awake what are you doing girl why are you drinking wine at 7 in the morning she says only three servings left, might as well. She's like, so I need you to catch me up on what happened since you've been here, Yasmin. And Yasmin's just like, oh. I'm back, I go pee. <laughs> She's trying to avoid talking about everything that happened. But I tell you after I come back from the back. So we really gotta tell Trinity about all our little gossip and stuff. And I don't know how to feel about that. I need to move some stuff around this apartment as, a, as well, cause, mm-mm. Okay, so she's just like, okay, catch me up. Look at all these bottles in front of our face. That's a shame. So Yasmin is going to be like, let's say, oh, that's trendy. Let's say, um, we're going to start off with Malik. You know, we're just going. It's just like, okay, so I met when I first got here, you know, after I got everything done in my apartment and everything. I met one of my neighbors, his name is Malik. He lives across the hall. Um, we met, we went out, he showed me around. He suggested I go to a friend or event and to make more friends, which is what I did. Okay, she said, yeah, that's good. It's good to get yourself out there. She's just like, yeah, at first it was fine. And then it, he ended up, you know, leaving me when we went out to a bar before the friend or event. 
She said he left you at a bar in a new city. She said, like, yeah, he did. And I don't understand why. And she's just like, okay, what else happened? So she's like, I did, you know, tell him about himself. And then the next day he did the Friday event. I met all these girls. They're really nice. He also sent me up on a blind date, which is also nice. She was really cool. Her name's Bess. She's in the marketing career. I like her, but it's just like nothing serious. And her boobs are just bouncing all over the fucking place, y'all. I, I can't take it. <laughs> and then we met. And then we just, you know, had a little one night thing. And then with the, why are you up? Sit, sit. So we could finish our story to our best friend. Oh my God. Okay, she's like, then we, I went and met these girls and we went to like a hookah lounge. They were all chill, all nice. They're all really pretty. I only even got close with only like four of them though. So there's um, Kayla. Um, uh uh, where's everybody? Y'all. Oh, <laughs> my bad. My bad. I like I don't play Sims, but I do. So there's Kayla, there's Farron, there's Armani, and Ivana. I feel like you will like them. She said, oh, okay, that's so chill. Really? She said, that's so chill, that's nice, you made some friends. And then she said, did you make any people that you don't like? She said, yeah, there's a girl who lives, my neighbor uh, is Layton. She lives next door, but I'm cool with her little sister though, Corey. I guess Layton didn't like me because she also likes, um, I think she likes Armani, y'all, or Kayla. I think she likes Kayla, and then, you know, me and Kayla have been hitting it off, and I guess Kayla told her about it, and then there's been issues. I never knew the real problem at first, because I didn't really notice, like, them two really hitting it off. She's like, oh, okay, okay. So you just, you know, took a girl from her, like you usually do. She said, the fuck you mean? I don't do that. She said, yes, ma'am. We went to middle school and high school together. I know how you are. She's just like, I didn't know that they were, you know, together. I just wanted to make new friends. Okay, she's like, so she's like, how are you and Kayla? She's like, me and Kayla are good. Oh, no, no, no. I didn't mean pick that, y'all. I'm sorry. If it happens, it happens, but no. But she said, how are you and Kayla? She said, me and Kayla are cool. Like, she's chill. Like, I like her a lot. But I don't want nothing serious, as you see. I'm still dating. I need to meet more people here before I settle down with anybody. She said, oh, I get that. I get that. What's wrong with you? Nothing? Okay. Ooh, a period about come on. And that's it, really. And now you're here. She said, then why'd you have me up here? Because I need your help. Like, you're in the model. No, we just started. Y'all up here trying to make each other's coochie. I mean, I mean, samoochies together. No. Um, no. And we're going to just brush her off as well. She's just like, you know, what we used to do. She's like, I'm girl. No, we're not doing that no more. She's like, all right, all right. Okay, I did not know that. Girl, you're straight. Why do you want to sleep with Yasmin? <coughs> you're really straight. Like, come on now. Are you trying to test the waters with your best friend again? You settled out in high school. But y'all are not doing that. Okay? Y'all are not doing that. So I gotta get a little backstory on Yasmin and um Trinity. So they met in middle school. Okay? Like, look at them. They look like they would be in middle school. So, you know, like to say like the obvious story, they just met, they sat together in class, became friends. It was all friendly, you know, good, good friend girl things in middle school until seventh grade, when Yasmin realized she actually likes girls. So her first kiss was actually with Trinity. Now don't get me wrong, I do think Yasmin still has little feelings for her, but I was like, I'm in seventh grade, right? No, eighth grade, they still, you know, they played it off. Like, okay, just my first kiss. We're just being friends, just doing things at a sleepover. Then, then we get to high school. You know, everybody's going through puberty. Everything's going through all the little emotions and everything. And, um, 
Yeah, so I was dating around. So was Trinity, but she was dating men, you know, boys, football players, basketball players, all that. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, yeah, I was just like, mm, I don't like that. I actually like my best friend, but I don't know how to tell her that, right? So I guess they, you know, the more they hung out, the more you guys caught feelings. They distance each other a little bit, you know, throughout high school. You know how high school relationships go. They fall off and come back together. And then, you know, Yasmin and her kissed again at another sleepover because Yasmin was like, hey, I want to try it again. I think I really like this girl, but I really don't know how to, like, to, you know, kiss her right. You know, Yasmin just trying to play it, make it seem like she don't really know, but she actually does know. And then they did, you know, a little makeout session, and then it got weird, and then they talked about it, all that yada yada. But overall, I do think Trinity does like Yasmin, but she's trying to, like, fight the fact that she does like her. But when that's her best friend, they've been through a lot. Plus, she's dating somebody right now. You won't see him yet, but she's dating somebody right now. Um, And Yasmin just, like, you know, playing the field. Her feelings are hurt. She don't know what to say. She's dating, you know, multiple females. It's hard for her to settle down because, you know, her feelings are actually with Trinity. But we need to get the girl over her, okay? We need to get her over her best friend. That's why Kayla and Bess are good distractions. But overall, they are good friends. She's like, oh, this place is dirty, though. They left my place a mess. She said, what happened? We had a sleepover. And, yeah. She's like, what happened at a sleepover? Oh, no, me and Kayla make down and we end up sleeping together. She's like, what? You just met this girl and you're sleeping with her? She's like, it was just casual sex. Nothing serious, nothing more. And Trina's just like, this girl is off the chain. Who's outside my door? Oh, the male lady. You're okay, lady, don't die. So she's like, okay, so what do you have planned for me today? Because like I told you, we need to talk about other things as well. And she's just like, what do you mean? She's like, okay, remember I told you just a few minutes ago, I think, I don't know, the sim girl actually likes to check her thought. So, yeah. So that's it. She's like, I want to, you know, branch out of more than just painting and everything. I love painting. That's my passion right there. Speaking of, do you have a job to do? What's today? Wednesday. Oh. She's like, yeah, I just need to do some things involved, like making more money. She's like, since you are in the model career, I feel like you should give me some tips and pointers what to do to get into it. She's like, oh, okay. I mean, I've been researching some stuff while I'm here. There is this photo studio we can go to like in like an hour or two to see if you can take some photos together. She's like, oh, I think I might like that for real. She's like, good, because we're gonna go anyway. She said, how much is it? She said, it's on me, since you wanna branch out. Um, I, I have somebody that she works there. I don't know if they're working today, but I'm gonna get back to you on it. Just, you know, finish your work stuff, and then we can go. She's like, okay. And then, well, not, not trendy. And then Yasin's just like, we're gonna go out to a strip mall because I need to get French out, get some more clothes, get some more stuff, and just eat. She said, we can do that and I'll drive there. She's, yeah, she's like, you brought your car? She said, yeah, I drove there. I didn't take a plane. She's like, oh, okay, girl, look at you. She said, yeah, it's nice. So we're going to go and drive around San Machu, you know, and then the other parks that are like the suburban area. Y'all go with me here because I don't know. This is a see how it goes LP. But we're going to um, clean the house up a little bit. We're going to get dressed. We're going to have gas and finish our work stuff. A lot. Um, we're going to have to call. I want her to text Bez back since we ignored her <laughs> during the whole, um, what is this convinced to come over? Like, what is that? Is that new? But we are going to call her when we're done. Throw up. Oh, Malik's here. Trina, can you let Malik in, please? Please and thank you. We need to get a bigger apartment. Yeah, I can't do these walls up all the time. She's like, hey, how are you? 
It's like, uh-uh. <laughs> Why is he like this, y'all? I cannot. She was like, oh, this one got an attitude on him. I'm like, dang, you all right? She said, hi, my name is Trinity. Who are you? He's like, what's up? My name is Malik. I'm a friend of Yasmin's. She said, oh, okay. I'm her best friend, Trinity, and I came to visit her and help her out with some stuff. He just like, ah, okay. I mean, ah. Uh -uh. Hey, why he gotta be so standoffish with her? Like, come on now. Ooh, he's like, oh, okay. <laughs> what you complaining about? You came over here to complain with me. I don't even know you. Oh, copyright. Big worm, I'm sorry to think. Okay. Um. All right, so we're gonna get dressed and get ready to go. I'ma need you to stop coming in my house and taking my drinks. I don't know you. Well, we do know you, but it's still rude. Clean it up, girl. And go get dressed so we can go. This is so nice. Y'all like this new G-Shade preset I got? I think it's the straw. You know what? How about this? Destroy. Okay. We just, yeah. You just pissed me off. Okay, let's go ahead and change our clothes. Who is crying? Girl, I didn't give her no new outfits. We're gonna do one we didn't see last time. Um... Yes, it is. I know they're gonna go outside and wear their other fits, but can you stop playing copyright shows so I can do this? Oh no, not that one. Let's do this one. Bye, beauty shop. Okay, we're gonna go. Why y'all seem so quiet? Should we take some selfies? We should. We'll take him at the um, strip mall. All right, so we are back. I thought I had set it to like a generic lot, but I didn't. Why is there a, see? Okay, but I didn't. So we are here at the Catch Studio and the coffee place, Pleasant Place Pizza. Um, It's a nice little studio, little Photoshop studio that Sierra the Sierra made. Again, um, we are here to do some things, something for Yasmin to make more money. I do feel like making, doing a modeling career for her would work out, because she's pretty. I feel like it'll work out for her. So Trini is gonna be like, okay, so we're gonna take some photos. We're gonna go inside and have you practice posing first, and then we'll get you some headshots and stuff. She's like, oh, okay, I got this, I got this. She said, did you pack another outfit? Because that's not gonna work. She was like, oh, yeah, okay. She said, all right, I'm, I'm going to meet you in there. I'm going to go in here right quick. She said, okay. Where you going? Girl, y'all supposed to be in the photo studio, not in here watching Harry Potter. Okay, we're going to go for headshots up here. So, yeah, it's going to have you come here and practice your modeling. Um, Actually, no, you're going to come stay here. And then Trinity is going to sit here and watch you do that. Yeah, that's how we're going to do that. Why the can't y'all get upstairs? Oh my gosh, what happened? Is it locked? No. So, I'm going to teleport you. And teleport you. Okay, you want to sit? No, 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 no. You're not doing that. You're going to come here. Please listen to me. So yeah, I'm gonna like she's not even with it. Like she feels like me now. I feel like dra draggy right now because I overslept. But we're gonna have her go here modeling, and you're gonna browse your model posing before you get started. She's like, okay, so I can see some cute ones I see on Instagram. You know, these girls are doing like Ari, Drea, and everybody else. She's like, girl, do your own. Do your own, and then you just do what makes you feel comfortable. She said, all right, all right, all right. Okay, so we're gonna do posing. Attempt to do a feminine pose. 
Like, see, is this right, girl? Am I doing this right? She's like, girl, try again. <laughs> She's like, all right, I got you, I got you, I got you. Okay, try again. Oh, she fell. Don't be embarrassed, yes. We gotta keep going, keep practicing. This is something you wanna do, remember? You gotta practice to make perfect. Girl, what the fuck is that? <laughs> oh my god. You can tell that I. <laughs> oh, I don't really put it in a spot like that, but okay. Keep going, gas me. Keep going. Don't get upset. Don't get mad. We're gonna be here for a minute anyway. Okay, there you go. There you go. Get more confident. See, see, she feeling herself now. All right, let's see, let's see. Try again. No. No. <laughs> Like she keep trying to leave to watch TV. No, girl. Let's hit again. Uh, yes, now. girl, get it. <laughs> she said, I think you're ready for your headshots. Perfect pose. Yes, I know that pose. Such smooth moves. Learning from the best. Look at those swifty poses. Yes, let's definitely learn something from that. You didn't, you know, embarrassing pose. She's sobering up. Oh, girl, you drunk? Oh, God. What oh, shot did you take? The Henny yeah. shot? <coughs> yeah. Okay. She said, do do it one more time. You know, I feel like you're ready for your headshots. Just do it one more time for me. She said, all right, I got you. I got you. I got you. Oh, girl. Wait, is that the actual feminine pose? Dawg, don't lie to me. Okay, I thought I was tripping. Girl. What you crying for? Why are you crying? Because you ain't hit that pose. <laughs> yes, me. She said, I didn't want to feel like this. I'm trying to make big money. Live in a big ass house. And get out that raggedy small apartment. Oh my god. Ooh, stew your mouth. <laughs> Whoa, that come looking. Okay, okay. She's like, girl, let's go to the headshot. She's like, okay. So, uh, <coughs> for her photos. Okay, put in Gasm's, not Gasm's, but Journey's in inventory. Okay, yes, this is perfect. Okay, uh, my light's still in the background. We're gonna do the far away of her. She looks good. Too bright. She don't need nothing. Should we do large photos? <clears throat> I think we'll do large photos. Or medium sized photos. Medium sized is fine. Okay, there's that one. Okay, you guys want to give you another pose, think about it. Okay, we're going to try this one. Oh, her hands are moving. Hold on. <laughs> yes. We're getting out there. Oh, she moves back and forth. I like that. Ooh. Trinity, you all guys didn't have to move, bro. I can't take photos with you not here, Trinity. <clears throat> Trinity said, fuck this. <laughs> Ooh, I like this. Ooh. Okay. And then you guys can have you do another pose. Okay, let's do this one. Do y'all like this one? Hmm. I don't know why they went like that. 
I got her body. Let's do a standing one. Ooh. Ooh. My sticker bud. Ooh, no. Because I'm not going to look at you right here. Ooh. Jenna, what are you doing? That's perfect, actually. I should be zooming out some more. That's cute. So we're building her portfolio. This is what we're doing. That was the word I was looking for. We are building her portfolio. I feel like it's nice though. Did I say it wrong again? Portfolio. Sorry, I, I speak fast. So when I speak or when I talk, everything don't come out like it's supposed to. And I hate it. We're gonna do like a far away picture and then like somewhat up close picture. So she can post for bad for baddies or um it's like I'm free okay okay let's go to the next pose <clears throat> that's hilarious me banned yeah it's me okay I like that photo but I don't want the lights though that's cute and then with this, we can do a full body one. Oop. This is cute, actually. This is really cute. Ooh, I didn't know I mean to do that, but. <laughs> okay, she's done with the <clears throat> bathing suit poses. I think we should do, okay, let's just stop posing. Okay, we should do one with her actual clothes on. Do like headshots of her. Um, which one has her face like actually out in a nice outfit? I like this outfit. So we can do some headshot poses with her like this. I'm gonna use, mm, I always use this one. I need another one that's like that. Model poses. Uh, I don't wanna do all in one, I should try seven. That's a cute headshot. No. Don't like her eyes look. Let's do eight. Eight is cute. Headshot pose. Okay, first of all, my camera angles is very like not there, and it's terrible. Okay, that's a cute headshot. Trina, complete this photo, please. Okay, that's a cute headshot pose. Do it this way. Her headshots like this. So yeah, this is cute. Her butterfly nails. Do the other pose. I want her finger on her face all the time. Uh, let's do four. Oh, okay. Okay, let's just change the pose in general. <laughs> Okay, so we find some more. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
Oh, let's use the iPhones. I found more selfies. Yay. Okay, uh, let's do... Okay, let's just go to my go-to's real quick. And do... I just say, I'm going to put this far. Ooh, I actually like that photo. And now I fold there. Lots of people like that. Okay, I can't really get posed right there. So no. Let's do four. Oh, that is actually really, really cute. Oh. She killed it with that one. So we're going to use these headshots to take to a model agency in San Marchino. Show their our portfolio. I know this isn't really a big model standards, but hey, that's what she gonna do. We got a portfolio with all of photos, so we're gonna do some more, you know, later on down the line once we get better at it. I have an actual photo shoot. Let's do smile. That is cute on her. I love it. Yeah, get like the right angle for your camera. And then we'll take a photo. I think we'll be good. This is cute. I love this actually. This in her inventory. Why does the screen move if you do that now? So you guys may have all her photos. Ooh, what is this? Oh shoot, we gotta turn that in. Stop posing. Um send to file for improvement. This doesn't mean uh, man. Oh my god, we'll edit it tonight. I don't feel like the thing is at home too. Drink that so how'd you like the um How'd you like the, uh, I can't think. She said, so how'd you like the little photo shoot? She said, it was fun. It was cool. It was straight. I mean, you know, it's my first time doing it, so I'm gonna have to get used to it. She said, yeah, you are. You're gonna get used to it. You're, gonna, you're actually gonna love it. You're gonna see that you love yourself more. You feel better in your skin, all that. That's why I like doing it, because it makes me feel confident. So, oh yeah, I can tell you confident, right? And it's just like, I just feel like it's out my comfort zone, but I like it because it's something new. But I still feel iffy about it. She said, you'll get to it. You'll get it. Do you want something to eat, something to drink, or what? So I'm going to order some drinks because I'm going to eat somewhere else. I should know. Or not. She's like, so where did you want to take me? I said, I want to take you to this little strip mall thing that we have here. And so that you can make sure, like, you can get stuff before you go back home and everything. So, okay, okay, we can go, we can go. Oh, wait a minute. Now some discourse between the two. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Not that face. What happened? What did she say? Trinity, what did you say? Pyro, no, for recalling your first flyer. But no, but what what did she say to you that made it seem like she had to get it? The job level went down. Not level, friendship went down. I don't know. They, they, they. Mm. We are here at the court shop. This is made by Sierra the Simmer. As you can, oh, I'm beyond calling us. Hold on. Hey, I think Jacqueline Le Chien. It's pretty cute to ask him out. I said, do what your heart tells you, girl, because I ain't about to tell you what to do with your heart. I barely know what I'm doing. Oh, we're going straight to Cinnabon. Okay. Now I want some Cinnabon for real. Oh, are you going behind the counter? You grabbed a hot dog. This is Cinnabon. I don't want a hot... Oh, she's going to the bathroom. Oh. Hi, barista girl. We want actual stuff. So in this place we have um 
Zales, Diamond, the Diamond Store. I've never been there. We have Papa John's. We have this. Uh, what is this? Torrid. We have Cinnabon. We have Claw, which is a nail place, and we have Uggs. So I just want to take the girls that just have some sun, some sun, really, some fun out and just, you know. I'm excited as a community lots so of the Sims can come, but I guess not. She's like, girl, where are all the people at? She said, I don't know. Hold on, can you order something? Oh, it's an actual Cinnabon food. I gotta place the actual stall down then. But this is the nail place. It's so cute. As you can see, they're packed and busy and booked. And then we have these Ugg plays. I like the Uggs. They're so cute. Like, I want all these in my closet. Y'all don't understand. I'm a fiend for Uggs. Look at them. Look at them. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Straight cute. And the one in the front. I wear kid sizes, so I know to get a lot. What are you doing? I'm watching TV. Why do all my lots end up a fail? I hate this. Okay. Oh, what's she doing? She ain't here waiting to get her nails done. Girl. Who's gonna do your nails? Ain't nobody here. Ooh, get a fresh set? Yes, ma'am. She ain't nobody here. Uh, steady sit. Steady sit. Maybe Yasmin can do your nails. <laughs> what? I didn't know you could do that. I never like used this before, so I didn't know the stuff you could do. Okay. Ask for a foot massage from Yasmin. No, we're not doing that. And I got a lash place back here. Only oh, one lash salon. That's crazy. Mm-hmm. But it's a cute place though. I'm gonna make it functional later. But it is cute. It's a good place to take pictures and everything. So you gotta be working her butt off in these bills, bro. I could never do this. She said, you wanna go to the strip club instead? She said, girl, yes, please. Get me out of here. Ain't nobody here. But these fake ass people. All right, so we are here at the Blue Flame Lounge again. The last, oh. The last time we tried to come here, it was like our girls left us. So maybe we, maybe we, maybe it's maybe we. No. No. We're not doing that music, okay? Oh, get it, get it, get it, Angela. Get it, Angela. But last time we were here, it wasn't really like, you know, popping, popping. But we are here. You know, she took us in her truck. Oh, Corey's here. Let's talk to Corey. We need to talk to her about her sister. Okay, we're going to talk to Corey right quick. I don't know where Trinity going, but she can't leave. Okay, so let's just, let's, no, we need to ask about another sim. We need to ask about her sister. You know her sister is working here tonight. So I'm gonna ask her about her. Like, um. She's like, hey, Corey, I need to ask you a question about Layton. She said, yeah, what is it? I don't know where me and Layton fell off at. Can you let me know? And she says, I like Layton. She's pretty cool. That's not what I asked you. And she's like, no, Layton, it's just that, you know, don't fight with her, girl. Please don't. It's just that, you know, when you were with Kayla, I believe, you know, at the hookah lounge, they went all, you know, slept together upstairs, right? Yasmin was like, no. I did not know this. Can you, what, what do you mean? She said, yeah, her and Kayla were sleeping together before, you know, I guess y'all two got together. And she's just like, oh, girl, you can lower your tongue. We're not talking to you like that. We're actually coming to you for concern. Lower your tongue. She's like, no, I never knew that. I just knew that they were like talking. I never knew they were sleeping together. She's like, yeah, that's why my sister's kind of like, eh, with it. Why are you shoveling snow? Why? I just saw you at the corner of my eye. Why? 
You come here. You need to continue your conversation with her. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm just ugly ass townies. Look at me like that. I ain't dance for y'all. Excuse me. She's like, oh, so you're telling me. <laughs> Can y'all get out the way before I delete both of y'all? Because I will. Like this. Bye, Dirk. Bye. Uh, I don't know who you are. Okay. She's like, yeah, I never knew that your sister was actually with Kayla for real. I was just, you know, asking her out and stuff. And when she started flirting with me, that's all that that was. I did not know. She never said anything when we started sleeping together. And Corey, oh, they sitting down for this conversation. Hold on, hold on. Oh, what? Are you pregnant? And by who? <laughs> Corey. No, she's not. Oh. <coughs> You're not gonna die at me because I don't know what silly is in these terms. She's like, yeah, I just. She was like, mainly my sister is just like mad and jealous of the fact that, you know, Kayla left her for you. Maybe you two should they'll have a talk and apologize to each other because when y'all fought, I didn't think it was fair. She's like, I, I agree. I did not want to fight your sister. I just, I was drunk. <laughs> My girls are there. Kayla was there. Y'all ruining my storytelling. Oh, she was right there the whole time. Well, basically, you know, they got to talk and apologize to each other and the fight weren't really what it's supposed to be. She said, I saw you talking to somebody. Who are you talking to? She said, I was talking to, you know, hold on. I was talking to that girl, um, Layton's sister, Corey, the one I told you about, the cool one. She said, oh, the girl you fought, sister. She's like, yeah. So what happened? Can you tell me what happened? She said, yeah. So apparently Kayla and Layton were actually sleeping together, and I didn't know that. I did not know they were doing that together when me and Kayla started, you know, flirting with each other. She said, okay, okay, what else? So apparently Layton is mad because Kayla just you know up and left her and ghosted her and decided to be with me instead. I'm not gonna be a part of that drama, but I do like Kayla. That is the problem, and I don't know what to do. Now I'm gonna have. Can she give advice? <laughs> um. Yeah, give confident advice. And I just don't know what to do with cars with me and Kayla because I actually like her. But then again, there's me and Bess as well. Even though the one with me and Bess, we're more casual than it is. Though, as much as me and Kayla flirt, me and Bess aren't really right there as well. She said, girl, do I need to stay here a little bit longer for you to sort this out? And then it's just, ooh, my voice cracked. <laughs> And then she's like, I really like the both of them, but I really have more of a connection with Kayla. Like, Kayla's the one that I really see myself being, you know, maybe something more than just sleeping around with. Sorry, y'all. And I just need to know whether or not to pursue that more. She said, I agree with everything you're saying. I just need you to honestly be honest with yourself and see what do you actually like this girl. Or do you just want to sleep with this girl? Same thing goes with Bess. You cannot be, you know, put your feelings into one. And then also, they might, like, what if Bess actually really likes you? And yes, I'm going, oh, I think she does. <laughs> Not that I think, I actually know that she actually likes me. Like, it is, it's, it's, it's obvious that she likes me. So she's like, why are you spending all time with Kayla when Bess how she likes you? She's like, I like Kayla. I know you like Kayla and all, but you should, like, look at the real thing. She said, I see what you're saying, but I'm having fun and no one's getting hurt. And at the same time, we just thinking, like, 
Okay. Where you been? Bungie? Uh -huh. Oh, honey, oh Ooh, they loud in my ear. So basically, Journey said, go with what you feel like is right, but at the same time, do not hurt both of these girls. And do they know that you're not, you know, trying to look for something serious? She's like, Kayla knows. Kayla knows that, you know, it's nothing for real. We just sleep together. She said, what about this? <laughs> She's like, I don't want to talk about it. Like, she said, maybe you don't want to talk about it because you actually hurt the girl feelings that you not really spend much time with her like you do with Caleb. Maybe it's the fact that Bess actually does have feelings for you. You need to own up to that and apologize to that girl as well. And also see if y'all can, like, do something more with it or let it go. Um, Yasmin's just like, oh, I, I want to think about that because... I like them both in her hair. She's thinking this. She's like, I like them both, but I don't want to drop nobody. I don't want to, like, you know, you know, what if Bess ain't the one? And then Kayla goes back to Layton. <laughs> Kayla, Layton, Bess, Yasmin. She said, Y'all are, it's too much really like actual drama when it comes to y'all. Y'all need to all sit down and set with straight. But before you do that, apologize to Layton, apologize to Bess. That's the only thing that's right. She's like, yeah, I hear you. I'm going to do those. Just not now. You, you hear me? Like, not now. Like, I got to sort my way about going things as well. Because I feel like I actually like Kayla. And I keep saying it to you. But you're saying you invest a child leave Kayla alone. Like, girl, I actually really like her. I don't want to do that. Do I be real myself or continue to be delusional? Oh. She's like, you know what? Do what you want. But I say apologize to all four of them. Well, all three of them. Right now. At, well, not right now, but soon. Apologize to all three. See, you need a friend like her around when it comes to people like Yasmin. This is me in real life. <laughs> but Yasmin, like, baby girl, come on. She's still talking about it like she don't want to hurt nobody. <laughs> Ooh, girl. You would be so cute with some makeover. Okay, can we watch some girls shake their booties and just leave it alone? Oh, they're naked. So, why are you on stage, Corey? Okay. <laughs> I guess we're going to go home and eat some sushi at 2 o'clock in the morning. So we're back home. I'm just going to have, you know, Trinity make some sushi for them. We're going to do, ooh, no. Uh, avocado, I don't want avocado rolls. Okay, we're going to make some avocado rolls. It has some drinks with um Trinity. Why they gotta walk around up like it's a big ass corner? What are you complaining about? What's dirty? What is dirty? What is on the floor? Oh, what is this? Oh, you need to do that right quick while she's making that. Do that. She's like, girl, you have one interesting life here in San Marcino. I could not live out here. My life is peaceful in Del Sol Valley. She's like, yeah, girl, I bet. I really freaking bet. She said, how are you and your mans, though? She said, me and my men are good. We are really, like, just calm sitting here. I mean, even though I suspect he's doing something behind my back, but until I actually, like, face it and deal with it, it ain't going to be talked about. And she's just like, you talking about me when you dealing with your own stuff. These sushi rolls look good, but I don't like avocado rolls. I got like tuna or salmon or crab in it, at least. They look good, though. Ooh, girl, you struggling with the chopsticks. You struggling with the chopsticks. Ooh, girl. <laughs> and Trini's just, not Trini, and Yas just working. 
So you gonna eat, girl? She's like, yeah, I gotta finish this before 9 a.m. tomorrow. That's all. It's actually really cute. I like that painting. Um, is there a way for us to make a portfolio, like a mod or something? What is this? Or oh, selfies? That's what I want to know. Is there a way for us to like, you know? Oh. How do I get active portfolio? Is it with the um, get famous mod? Or uh, what's the mod called? Road to fame. Because I want to do a portfolio, like a real portfolio of all her pictures. Also, we need to start posting on Instagram as well. So we can start making some more money and getting, and getting our face out there. The way y'all are just so quiet, you guys, like this is the friendship that's peaceful and you don't have to really talk to be around each other. Just, you know, it's not awkward silence. It's the reassuring silence. But she is struggling with them chopsticks. <laughs> they ain't asking to take you this long. I don't draw, really, so I don't know. We're just gonna get our 350 gig pay. I guess try modeling. Can you stop putting it on the floor and put it in your inventory? You are killing me with this. Oh no. Oh! Oh, it's loading screen art. Oh, we got some money too. Ooh, you have a trouble too. I'm gonna need y'all to get together with the chopsticks, please. Ooh, we need to see our photos. Where are we gonna put them? In here? Come in here so we can see these photos. I wanna see how they look. Okay, so we got the wall here oh these look so good of her Ooh, look at her i love all of these oh i didn't mean to take that one delete this is so nice here you go Oh, she in her modeling bag. These are all good photos. Such a poor portfolio. I love it. I love it. I'm just going to say that this stack, if we could name it, it'd be better. But this is her portfolio of all her pictures. I wish we could mix and match the way they put together. But yeah, that's her portfolio. And it's bomb. All right. I guess we're going to end it right here with Yasmin struggling with her chopsticks. You know. And then, guys, hold on. We're giving a perfect picture. And, guys, I want you guys to tell me what you think. Do you think Yasmin should apologize to all three girls? Do you think Yasmin should, you know, continue to do what she's doing, don't care what nobody's feelings are feeling. Well, doesn't care that she's hurting nobody's feelings. Like I said, I talk fast, so things don't come out how they're supposed to. My bad. And then, do you think, who do you think Yasmin should be with? Or take more seriously? Best, because Best actually likes her, but Yasmin doesn't like her like that. Or Kayla, Yasmin likes her, but Kayla's also doing the same thing as her, sleeping with other people. But I do think she should apologize to Layton. Because Layton didn't do nothing wrong to her. She was just trying to turn the music down. And then, you know, drunk Yasmin just, you know, didn't like that. And fought her for no reason. So, I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.